Welcome to another two minute lesson. Today's lesson is on concrete moisture testing and why it's important. Moisture is by far the most common issue that can compromise a concrete asset and the coating that protects it. Concrete is prone to moisture issues due to channel of capillaries that form during the hydration phase or the hardening phase. The number of channels can be dramatically increased or decreased depending on the water to cement ratio used in the mix. For this lesson, when it comes to concrete moisture testing methods, I'll focus on ASTM testing methods that are used by the concrete industry. ASTM D4263, indicating moisture in concrete by plastic sheet method. This test method involves taping an 18 by 18 inch plastic sheet to a concrete surface and then waiting at least 16 hours. Visible condensation on the sheet or darkening of the concrete indicates excessive moisture. Any coating applied to the surface may be at risk of failure. It's a useful surface level test, but it sheds little light on the severity of the moisture problem within the concrete slab. ASTM F1869, measuring moisture vapor emission rate of concrete subfloor using calcium chloride. In this test, a dish containing calcium chloride is set on a concrete surface and covered with an airtight dome. After waiting 60 to 72 hours, the dish is weighed to record pounds of water admitted per 1,000 square feet. Failure is identified if the calcium chloride tablet is above 3 pounds in weight. ASTM F2170, determining relative humidity and concrete floor slabs using in situ probes. In this test, a sleeve or a probe are inserted into holes drilled into the concrete. The test is more precise because it can show humidity readings at various depths in concrete. Probes can also be left in the concrete to deliver readings over time. ASTM F2659 Preliminary Evaluation of Comparative Moisture Condition of Concrete Using a Non-Destructive Electronic Moisture Meter A concrete moisture meter measures concrete water percentage in a non-destructive manner. The meter is ideal for determining the moisture conditions of concrete. The protective coatings industry recommends an all of the above approach to concrete moisture testing to get the best picture of how moisture impacts concrete surfaces. You should also follow coating manufacturer recommendations regarding proper application of coatings based on the results for moisture testing. Once concrete moisture testing is complete, owners have a wide array of methods at their disposal to combat moisture problems. Available moisture mitigation options include weighting, dehumidifying, employing vapor barriers or retarders, moisture mitigation systems, design against moisture, and the use of green concrete coating systems. I hope that you found this two minute lesson very valuable. Please check back next Saturday for a new two minute lesson. Thank you.